As we all know, there are many ongoing issues in and around our community, whether it be potholes, the weather, or the budget. Well, WSKG opened up a contest for students' voices to be heard on a very important topic. I spoke with Owen Zhang, a junior and at Ithaca High School, as well as the winner of WSKG's contest, to find out more information. So, Owen, can you tell us what the contest with WSKG was about? Yeah. So the contest was called the Student Perspectives Extreme Weather Adaptation and Climate Change Contest. This past winter was quite prolonged and stormy, so WSKG wanted to know how local students felt about extreme weather and climate change. It asked students to respond to one of several prompts in an essay accompanied by audio, photography, or video. And these prompts ask students about how their family or community has been affected by extreme weather and what the community or the government could do to address climate change. And the contest was open to students uh, from seventh grade to twelfth grade. And why did you decide to enter in this contest? So I carpool with my neighbor and his friends to school every day and we listen to the radio on the way. And I kept hearing about this contest on the radio and since the topic of climate change is something I'm fairly interested in and since I really enjoy writing I decided to submit a piece. Um, and what was your essay topic about exactly and what was your perspective on it? So the prompt I chose to answer was, if local government officials asked you how they could reduce greenhouse gas emissions and better prepare for extreme weather, what recommendations would you make? And my essay discussed things individuals could do and things the government could do to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. So first I did some research about climate change and greenhouse gas emissions, and I then focused my essay on uh, recommendations um, on practical actions that I thought ordinary people would be willing to do, you know, like reducing the consumption of electricity or of manufactured goods, through simple things like turning off lights and you know wearing more clothes in the winter instead of raising the thermostat. And I also talked about vehicles, you know, um, about how people could consider phasing out old vehicles and replacing them over time with electrics or hybrids. And of course, I also mentioned bicycling and walking. And I tied the topic of transportation uh, to the community by mentioning public transportation. And I also discussed you know, education and public outreach and their importance to conservation efforts. And do you see yourself getting more involved in this area in the future? You know, I can't say I'll become an outspoken activist about climate change, but I appreciate how researching for and writing this paper uh, was a learning experience for me, and doing so reminded me of the significance of climate change. Uh, I had a fifth grade teacher who really cared about the environment and taught her students many things about conservation. And as a result, I tried to reduce my impact on the environment, um, but over time I began to think less about the environment and climate change, but writing this essay encouraged me to start being more conscious of the environment. Well, congratulations on your win. Yeah, thank you. Yep. Well, we would like to thank Owen for joining us today. If you want to check out his work and other students' work as well, you can go to wskg.org. For WRED, I'm Ploy Tutin